What's going on everybody, Gaming Goofus here, and welcome to my channel. Now, today guys, we're going to be looking at something that I think is pretty cool. And my first video for my new channel is going to be the best recording software to use. You can live stream, record, it's just all around amazing. So guys, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go to your browser. For this example, I'll be using Google Chrome. You want to open it up, wait for it to load. I know my internet's slow. So you just want to go to the search bar or whatever, and you want to type in OBS. So the first one that should pop up, and you can see that this is trustworthy, so you won't get a virus from this. You want to go to Open Broadcast Software. So this is what it'll say. Um, you could kind of read about what is OBS. Open Broadcast Software is a free, is free and open source software for video recording and live streaming. Support supported features include encoding, blah blah. You could just read all that nerdy geek stuff. Um, so this is all the stuff. And look, OBS is completely free, not a dime. There are no subscriptions, no payments at all. OBS is available to everyone with source code publicly available on GitHub for anyone to help contribute. Completely free. So, you get you can get OBS Classic or get OBS Studio. Now, you should I got OBS Classic. So you want to click on this button, and it'll download OBS right here. Now this is for Windows 7, 8, and 10. If you're below 7, then you might not want to download it, and it won't work for you. So I will just pause the download because I already downloaded it. In fact, I'm using it to record this video. So as you can see here, right over here, opening this up. This is OBS. Now, it's got like a bunch of little desktops because well, I'm recording my screen, recording the OBS software while it's recording. So it just does an endless little loop. So as you can see, there's a bunch of different things. There's settings, start streaming, edit scenes, stop recording, start recording, global sources, blah, blah, blah. So this is for streaming. This is for recording. If we can go to settings... This is all the different stuff you could look at. So general, all that. Encoding, you could look through all this stuff. I'm not really a geek with computers, but set your bit rate. So you could set your um, your settings to what your computer can handle. Um, I don't have a very good PC. I have a, I'm running on a laptop right now. But you could see you could set um, microphone. If you have a microphone like, like a Yeti or something, you could plug it in and set it. And this this is pretty easy. Now you also have um, hotkeys, which basically means you don't have to like. Cause if let's say I wanted to record, and oops, and if I click start recording, this would be start recording if I wasn't recording with OBS right now. So if I wanted to start recording, and I clicked start recording, then it might record be recording this. You don't want that in your video. So if you have a hotkey, it's a lot easier. So I set my and you could say your hotkey for the same thing. My hotkey is set to zero, so I can just press zero and it'll end my recording. And you could do all the stuff: push talk, blah blah, mute, unmute mic, blah blah. Um, advanced. This is more advanced stuff for people that are smarter than me. Um, this is stuff for people that are smarter than me. And yeah, this is the microphone noise gate and as you can see um, how you know as I'm talking the microphone is going up because of higher decibels and I'm not really sure what this is scene switcher not sure but if you guys want to see like more of a tutorial on OBS just look at a different video I'm just kind of showing you what it is and how to download it and so yeah that's basically OBS um, I'm using it to record right now and as you can see right here guys I have a bunch of different games now if you go to the if you now right now since I'm um, recording I don't think it's gonna oh it does so you could actually go to add and you could add a window tap capture a monitor capture an image an image slideshow text video capture device or game capture now game capture is for like games like minecraft and such like that um, video capture device is actually for a face cam so if you guys ever wanted to use a face cam in your videos you would be able to do that with the video capture device and right um, over here it'll show you how long you've been recording for so I've been recording for 4 minutes 50 seconds just about and this shows you your frames 30 FPS so I hope you guys did enjoy this little tutorial on how to get OBS 
and why it's the best. Oh, and also this is the streaming button. Um, I'm not going to demonstrate streaming because I'm recording at the moment. It might mess up my recording. But yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy. Um, OBS is very fast to download. It takes not even a couple seconds to download. And if you think this is a virus, trust me, it's not. You guys can look more videos on YouTube. It Trust me, it is not a virus. And like I said before, you could just read this. You know, you could donate and stuff. You don't need to donate, though. Um, you could go to help if you have help with this. You could go to forum, blah, blah. Just more on the website, you know, to guide you through. So... Yeah, I, got, I hope you guys enjoyed, and this is actually what I use to re, gonna be re using to record my videos. Now I'm gonna be trying to record one video per week. Um, I'm not sure because school is gonna be starting soon. I think I start school August 22nd, so I'm gonna try to push out one video per week because I'm gonna have lots of homework and stuff, you know. So yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy this detailed instruction on OBS and. Yeah, I will see you guys in the next video, So, and welcome to my channel. Um, my name is Gaming Goofus, and I hope you enjoyed. Peace out.